Yo, what's good? It's been a while since I did a video on this game. Let's get it. What I'm gonna do today is something different than what I usually do. Usually I just have an idea, I build some teams and we go in for a battle. But today, I'm gonna pick random here and get us a character. Well, we're gonna get us two characters. The first one is King Piccolo. Uh, and let's see who's the second character here. What do we got here? Ooh, Fasha. Okay. So now we go back in, but we're going to, into DP battle mode. Now we're going to have two teams based around those characters. So they have to be characters related to the character. Not necessarily by DNA, but you, you know. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. Come on. Anywho, we got King Piccolo at a very low cost of three. Excellent. In color two, why not? Okay, now clearly we can easily link any Namekian to King Piccolo, right? And build up a team on that. But at the same time, we could also link them via just being Dragon Ball. We're gonna try and go with like the closest links to these characters first and if we have any extra points to fill out the team we'll do that so of course we got to go with an early piccolo that would be the closest piccolo to king piccolo let's go like costume three why not we still have two more slots 10 points uh, let's see if we got anybody else in here that will be fitting you know what's funny? Kid Goku would actually be a decent fit. But instead, we're going to throw another Piccolo. Put in Piccolo into the team. Color four. Why not? All right, let's see. So we have a few points left. Four points. That's just enough for Kid Goku. Let's just go ahead and throw him in there. Boom. There you go. First team achieved. All right. Now for the Fasha team. Find it first. They basically got us all set up for what's going to be our team. Freaking basic armor sayings. Of course, the first person to pick would be Bardock. He's at a five point cost. And then... Who else can we add in? Uh, it would be closer to putting in somebody like Raditz, I would say, right? I believe Raditz definitely fits in. And we have seven points left. Let's see. So we're only going to get one of these characters. Hmm. I think we should just throw in Vegeta just because. I mean, Turles. I was going to put Turles on here, but, you know. Actually, you know what? Turles is about as canon as Fasha, so yeah. Let's get him on the team. There you go. The team is sealed. Let me see how the options of, of threes that we can put in here. If there's anybody that would actually work. Yeah, it's going to be a no. That's definitely going to be a no. So, yeah. That's what we're running with. It is what it is, you know. Let's just... Instead of randoming up a sound, I'm going to random it myself. Uh. All right. Now, let's see how this battle goes. Just in time, because I want to play. You want to fight this? All right, let's see what we got here. The King Piccolo team versus the Fasha team. Ooh. 
full power energy wave. Mash is basically tied right now. Oh, the Kalash. Another Kalash. Fox is probably going to win because that right side always wins these. It is what it is. Especially with it being normal. Because usually I try to add extra stuff to the characters with customization. But with just normal versions of these characters, the right side is always going to win a Clash. It is what it is. Sometimes life ain't fair. All that means is that the, the characters on the left are just going to have to fight a little harder. To make up for it, you know? Right now, King Piccolo is getting demolished. Misses with his eye beams. Initiates another clash, which he's losing. I think it's about time to tag. There it is. Bringing in the early Piccolo. Loses a clash immediately. There we go. P. Wild Sense. Wild Sense meant nothing. Oh, 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 oh. And there goes all of Piccolo's key. <laughs> Was it worth it, Piccolo? He's not answering. He's, he's too busy fighting right now. But, oh, the transformation and the zoom in on the butt. I don't know. I don't know what was with that camera angle, but uh, we do not condone such camera angles, cameraman. What do you mean I told you to specifically get that angle? How dare you? Here's your bonus. It's not for the camera angle you did, but because you work very hard for us. Anywho, back to the match. Bosch is out here in eighth form. Destroying another Piccolo. Looks like she might take this whole team down on her own. On her own. Why did it end this way? <laughs> On her own. This wasn't how it was supposed to be. My goodness. She is demolishing this team right now. And he keeps trying to do that super that clearly isn't working. I think it's about time you tag too. Oh, flip. That actually hit. Good job. Oh my goodness. Bosh out here giving a new meaning to back shots. By that I mean she literally shot him in the back. Anywho, he's dead. On to the next Piccolo. We got superhero Piccolo here. The Clash. Piccolo loses. Oh, flip. A dang rock at him. A very primitive but effective attack. It looks like she's about to tag. She switched who's who's in the um reserve slot. I guess she wants to give her other teammates a chance to play. Because she definitely doesn't need to. She's been demolishing their team. There it is. Who comes out? Bardock. Bardock from the Broly movie. Don't worry, we'll still count you as Bardock. You're just wearing a different costume, that's all. Bosh can still have you on the team. Grenade. Oh, 
fly grenade. Wow, since oh Super Saiyan. It's Bardock time. He's the only member of the team that can go Super Saiyan. Let's see what he does with this power. Remember, Bardock, when you reach that upper level, your mind, body, and soul will be one. It's a sacrifice. It takes hard work. It's a way of life. When you got the glow. Oh, Flip is dead. <laughs> All right. Curtis has emerged. What will he be able to do against these, against this monster or Piccolo? This is the only one that's been putting in any work. I was going to say against these mighty warriors on the other side, but there's only been one character that's putting in any work. And it looks like he's about to go. Should probably tag before he dies. Oh, look at that. He threw an energy ring. I don't know how you get hit in the middle of that, but hey, it happened. Now we got the little Goku coming out here, ready to fight. Getting blasted in the face by a much bigger and more mean Goku. One, two, one, scissors, paper. Oh, man. Bruh's out here getting the munchies in the middle of a fight. He's like, man, I need a snack. Ooh. Oh, he's transforming. I guess that's what happens when you eat too much. He kept, he kept on eating those fruits and now he's become giant. He's become more body positive. He's become plus size, like an elf. You know that manga's getting the anime. <laughs> like I have a couple of volumes of the manga, with, with, well, with my manga books in the closet. I was about to say in my manga collection, but I don't even know if I should call it a collection. It's not a ton of books, but I guess a, a, a group of things that you've collected, no matter how many is a collection, so it's in my manga collection. Anyway, Goku's dead. They only managed to get a couple of volumes because, you know, they cost money, but, um... <laughs> I'm up to date with all of the, um... the dang online translated chapters that you can find on the interwebs. It is very fun read. I would recommend it. Freaking plus size elf is great. I like when they put the cone around her freaking arm, neck like she was a dang animal to keep her from eating fries. It was great. That book is hilarious. And while I was talking about a book, the Saiyans have taken over. They have at least three characters left. While King Piccolo's team is down to one. Let's see if he can bring it back. These clashes are not helping. Oh, Black Monday.
who told you I was outside on Monday. How dare you? Oh, oh, oh. Wham. Ton of damage. He's activated his Saiyan soul. My goodness, this is just about over. Let's see how this fight ends. I was about to say it's going to end by key blast. Yes, it is. The disrespect. No way that I can be beaten. Anywho, that's going to do it for this. I hope you guys enjoyed this battle. Let me know in the comments below. Let me know. Let me know how much you enjoyed this. You know, if you did hit that like button and uh, yeah. Tell me if you like the format where we just find a couple of randoms and then make DP teams based around them. I think it's pretty dope concept. Anywho, I'll see you guys next time. Peace out and have a great day.